In right now with breaking Space City news, a final countdown to the return of astronauts stuck in space for nine months. Astronauts Sunny Williams and Butch Wilmore are set to return to Earth within the hour. The return has been delayed several times after mechanical issues with their spacecraft. KHO 11's Amanda Henderson live at the Johnson Space Center with more on how the return trip is going. Amanda. Well, it seems like everything is going exactly as planned, Sherman. When we were inside a building that's to my left, but that's where they've got the radio transmissions from inside the capsule going right now. Everybody's just waiting for that moment when splashdown is going to happen, when they can welcome home Butch and SUNY. Obviously, they won't be back here in the Houston area for a couple hours. We anticipate that being a little bit later tonight around 10 p.m., but they are just so excited for them to be back here on Earth because this was a 10 day mission. They were only supposed to be there for about a week and a half. That's now turned to nine months. They were on the first ever mission with this particular craft when the thrusters started having issues and that's when they realized there were some mechanical issues that they needed to take care of. So they were at the ISS for all this time. They were able to really take in a lot of detailed notes that they're bringing back with them and now after several delays, this crew is heading home. We saw that video where they were able to officially detach from the ISS late this late last night, early this morning. But I mean, they're saying it's going to be a party here because they're just so excited in about an hour. They'll be home and we'll have that for you live. We'll send it back to you guys in studio. All right, you know they'll be excited to be back on terra firma, as they say. Thank you, Amanda. And of course, we'll be checking in with you all evening, bringing you the splashdown live right here on air. Of course, here in Space City, a lot of folks will be keeping a close eye on that splashdown. All right, Pat Cavlin, this is happening, of course, along the Florida Gulf Coast. Big question, weather, any consideration? No, weather looks great. I, they couldn't have picked a better day to come back to Earth uh, weather-wise. Uh, you can see the splashdown path here. This, the, uh, the, the spacecraft will move its way over southern Mexico, over the Bay of Campeche, and then eventually into the northeastern Gulf of Mexico. The splashdown targets somewhere uh, just off the Big Bend coast of Florida. And on satellite, you can see there's not even a cloud in the sky, so weather could not be better across that entire path uh, to the splashdown target. 